So I'm going to talk about this blue and white state variable filter. We have the cutoff resonance and CV attenuator for the envelope in. One volt per octave temperature compensated tracking. We have in one which is AC coupled, in two which is DC coupled, and then high pass, band pass, and low pass out. And right now we're just sending uh, the filter a sawtooth wave from the Dixie. So let's listen to what it sounds like. And so usually resonance sounds best from uh, around 3 o'clock onwards. So I could put it at 12 o'clock, cure the difference. Z sounds more juicy three o'clock and past and it does self oscillate but it's not obviously a sine wave it's more of some weird chaotic waveform so let's listen to the other states of the filter so here's band pass A little bit more resonance. And here's high pass. And so let's put some CV into here, see what it sounds like. We're just taking an envelope from maths. We could send it some more CV. Send it something from the morphing terrarium. Let's listen to the different states. And high pass. Let's turn up the resonance. And here's band pass with resonance all the way up. And low pass. Um, other than that, another thing to note is that N2 is DC coupled, so well, let's listen to what that sounds like. So this is N1. Through the AC coupled. And through the DC coupled in. It's better for filtering CV and slow moving sort of waveforms. So D 
DC versus AC. Thanks, that's it for now. We'll look at the EQ and uh, the Tenumix next.